my name is Aqua Aqua Fresh. I'm back and I'm better, fresher than ever, as you know it. Hey. <laughs> Welcome back to my YouTube channel, guys. Happy New Year to everybody who hasn't seen my Q&A. Please go check it out. So today I'm standing here. So I'm ready. Guys, I'm so excited. So, you already know, today is story time, as you can see by the title. This is a story that just you know was at the tip of my head and i was like let's see if it will be cool to share it hopefully it'll be interesting i hope you guys enjoy don't forget to give this video a thumbs up go give it a thumbs up right now don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and turn on your post notifications for more upcoming videos <laughs> let's get into it okay so get cogi mini skates <laughs> Okay guys, so story time. So I was about how old? I was really young guys. I don't remember every single detail. So I was probably less than nine years old. That's what you should know. And I was living in Duzuma, East Section Tovita. Shout out to my Duzuma gang, Kwamashu gang, my hometowns. So yeah, so one of the days my mom was at work, right? And my aunt, who usually, my mom's younger sister, usually looked after me. I used to go everywhere with her, do everything with her. But this time around, she had to go somewhere and I couldn't go with her. Anymore. So what happened is she left me at my cousin's place, right? Her kid's home, right? Paternal side. <laughs> so I'm Chiyakona because we used to alternate. I used to go there, they used to come there. You know, you know this little gang, how we be doing with visiting cousins, sisters, brothers, whatever. So yeah, it was one of those things. So Ngang Yoka Dakota, basically they were gonna uh, look after me for the day or the afternoon or however long they were gonna go for. So yeah, bang. So my aunt struck me off there and then she went. So now my cousins are not there. So I'm like, okay, what am I gonna do here? So one of the children from the household we're at a party up the road, right? So, okay, cool. I'm like, I okay, now me, I've been invited to this party. Let me just go. Even though I don't know this person who's actually having the party. But if I'm invited with my cousin, let's go. I go with them. Bear in mind, mind you, the tricky thing is... <laughs> do you guys know when it's a birthday party? It looks sheen, like... A bash. It's per it's like basically a bash. You know, kids will dress up. There will be tables, balloons everywhere. Like the deco is on point. Kids are answering, swagged up, and everything. And then you get me, who was just taken off the streets on some. Let's go. You need to go to this place because I'm going. You're gonna be home alone. This and that and the third, right? Fine, Minage. I'm wearing my red ass outfit first of all, and I'm dirty because I've been playing on them streets. Fine, cool. Moving forward, <laughs> I go to the party. I get there, guys. Mm, I'm standing in the corner, like, damn. Checking myself out, like, yo, this is not it, man. Like, I'm so dirty. I don't even look good. My outfit ain't popping. All these kids, you know, when kids dress up for Christmas and they make sure, go to you knows, go to, hey, I'm at a birthday party or today is Christmas. Fine. So, like, now I'm like, okay, I'm standing around there. I'm feeling embarrassed. I'm like, what's happening here? Um, would they even like me? These kids aren't even talking to me. They're not sitting with me. Is it because I don't look good? So now I'm like insecure and I'm embarrassed and it's a whole party. Everyone is happy, having a good time. So now I think, oh, I actually have an outfit at home. Like I could just go home and change, right? Like normal kid would think, like a normal kid would think. I'll just go home, I'll change look cute come back to the party even though home there's no one at home <laughs> um i'll make a plan you know there's i can make a plan <laughs> fine <laughs> i chill around for a bit hoping to make like because this place this area of my hood i uh, don't really 
go play there. You know, I'm always by my home. So I don't really know the kids around the area like that. I just know my cousins, you know. So it was tricky for me to like kind of make friends all of a sudden, dress like this, dirty, at a party, and they don't even know me like that. So it's like, whew, okay. So I think, I okay, cool. So in order for me to fit in, I need to go switch up. Then I'm like, how the hell am I going to tell the grand I'm at that I'm going to, I'm going home to change, to come back to go to the party, yeah, well, and I know she's going to say no because she knows that no one is at home. So I'm like, I okay, cool. I'm just going to sneak out some way or another. Go, try go around so that they don't see me at the house that I'm at. Go home, change, and come back, <laughs> right? Simple, fine. I go around the house behind so that they don't see me like like on the other side of the road like not the main road where everyone was at the other side right it's because it's like a it's like a circle nyana, you know so i can go home whatever and clap the distance is like from sun coast to clap circus circus yeah, more well, on the beach front if you guys know but obviously because it's still and their roads and pathways it's gonna seem longer okay cool hi <laughs> i go home guys and obviously i don't have a key i know i'm not ins and outs of my crib so i think i jumped into some window or whatever and then i had this white skirt short mini skirt <laughs> I had this short mini skirt, it was white and yeah, it actually never fitted me properly. So that's the reason why I hadn't worn it ever since it had been bought. Yeah, well, okay, sure. Hope you're keeping up. <laughs> so I go home, I wash my I, I, I wipe my feet, my legs, you know, I'm just trying to be clean, pour lotion, and then I put on the skirt. First of all, it's huge. Second of all, I don't have a belt my size. Fine, I make another plan. I try look for in time or like a, a string I can at least put and tie it and tie it up and hold it tight, hold it together, you know, so I can be blackling. <laughs> but okay, cool, fine. I am totally, I don't, okay, fine, I'm totally stringy. I'm like, what can I do? I try and find the time. Don't ask me why, but I try and find, you know, those long ass, um, those long. I did a thread, a thread of grass, but anyway, I don't know if you guys know, but I tried, tied with that, it wasn't tight enough, so I was like, okay, this thing's still falling down to my ankles, so plan C, I'm like, A, I'll just use my mom's belt, right? <laughs> yeah, boy. Bear in mind, this is like a seven, eight year old, about to use a old woman's belt, <laughs> basically. And then I'm gonna make it work, right? So I take the belt, I put it on, and it is humongous. I'm like, child, how are you gonna make this work, right? I'm home alone in this huge house. I'm trying to look cute and clean. I've got all these struggles happening, like taking place. Okay, fine. Be fine, band me, allow me, right? Put my belt on. It's huge. You know when the belt sticks out, sticks out, and it's, it, 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 it doesn't sit on the, on the, it couldn't, it couldn't even sit on my waist. I had to put it on my, what is this, hips, the collarbones, so that it, it doesn't fall. Yeah, well, so I'm get faggy and then I'm like, holy snap, I need to make an extra hole because this ain't fitting my waist. Then I'm thinking, but this is my mom's belt, what if she sees that? There's an extra hole that I was wearing her belt and, and then <clears throat> I get in trouble, right? So I'm like, I okay, let me just wing it. I take a knife, then I start digging a hole, right? Digging a hole in my mom's belt. This is her work belt, it's food, right? We're not the richest people. Okay, cool. Fast forward. I'm ready. This belt is huge. This kit is literally Guys, literally the skirt was short, short, <laughs> huge, huge belt, crop top. I, I forgot to mention a crop top in my A. It's a short, deep belly ring, you know what I'm saying? But it's fine. 
on my flip flops and we go. I now I'm ready for the party. Kind of feeling a bit uncomfortable because I know the situation here ain't it. But it's cool. We'll rock it, right? We'll rock it. We cute now. We cute. We go. Say I'm say party. Imagine get excited. I'm gonna be part of the gang, part of the squad. I'm gonna have a good time. Take pictures. Okay, cool. So we go and then I get back to the party. Same feeling like it, and I'm standing there like, okay, okay, cool. Let's see what happens. Then the girl stopped saying, oh, I like your skirt, you look cute, whatever. I was like, yeah. And then they're like, Manja, what happens with the belts? Like, don't you have a belt your size, girl? Like, what's popping with that? You must go change your belt so you can look nice in pictures. And I'm just like, wow, after I've tried to maintain the standard, I've tried to maintain the standard, but still nothing. Guys, you know, that's when I regretted even going to the party. And even worse, I regretted saying, go change, I want it. Like, why did I go and change? Now I'm standing there thinking, now I'm uncomfortable. I, I can't really move around. I need to hide this belt. I'll be sitting like this the whole time. It was just a disaster, guys. It was just a disaster. I um, was waiting to go back home. I just wanted the day to end, right? Just need to go home, chill, play with my friends, wear my dirty clothes, be great. I'm thinking the day is over. Mm -mm. No, 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 no. Fine. My mother comes back. <laughs> my mother comes back home. I'm not at home. The whole, apparently I had left things out Jay, I had left a mess type of vibe, right? Because I'm a kid, I'm not gonna think clean up, clean after yourself. You made a mess, someone noticed that you were here, then you left. I mean, it's just like my dirty clothes lying around, so you know, fine. Are you my speaking I'm glad, I'm glad on some. What are you doing here? What are you doing here, mate? <laughs> like, okay, say, I'm again. I'm around people, I'm embarrassed, it's late. I think it was around about like five, six o'clock even. But okay, fine. So um nyama, street lights, I'll get baby. And a crop top. I'm at a party she has no idea about, people she does not know of. I should be home. Like what is going on? Yeah, well, she doesn't understand who's a mukedu one or two a klagani pum six. Now I'm out here on some, mm, I'm just happy you're here. Let's go home, mom. And she's like, all right, cool, let's go home. <laughs> on the way, she says, jab, 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 jab. I'm like, mm -hmm. yeah, let's go home, mom. Stop looking at me too much. Like, let's just go home. Let's have a good time. We're back from work. Let's just, just go chill. Let's go hang as girls. Guys, I figured it, guys. We arrive and... Next thing, young happy band, she undoes my belt for me. Hey, Lule. <laughs> now, guys, you know, <laughs> you know, when the belt goes like a snake, you know, you know, it's, it's about to go down. Next thing, boop, 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 boop. All, you, all you should know is she was coming at me, asking me questions I could not answer. What has it banded? Len Engangi Kogil, Len Gilen Zimbabwe, Len Engangi of Flexangalo, Wang Shang, guys, Wang Gisha. I got the beating on my life, I'm not gonna forget that day. That was the last day ever I decided to go to a party without anyone's consent. Try dress up, look cute for no, like, I was done with parties. <laughs> Unless. It was home, but like at least it was Ipati Asekai, you know what I'm saying? Or literally next door, not on some the other kids' cousins' party. But yeah, guys, I got the beating of my life. So um, I think ever since that day in Jeffords, I was never a fan of dressing up girly and trying to fit in. And yeah, I'm alive today. All those made me who I am. So 
it is what it is but anyway i hope you guys enjoyed that story it was a little cute short story time nothing too much you know nothing too extravagant i'm excited can't wait to go to tops <laughs> thank you guys so much for tuning in once again thank you all for the love thank you all for the love and support don't forget to give this video a thumbs up don't forget to comment anything about anything really i will comment back i love you guys and see you next time bye